Iconic U.S. brand Tupperware is shutting down their last plant in the United States in South Carolina, effective immediately. Yeah, that's right. The iconic brand Tupperware here in the U.S. is shutting down its last remaining U.S. manufacturing plant out of South Carolina. This is pretty crazy. It's been around as long as I can remember, as long as my parents, as long as probably my grandparents. It's nuts. Tupperware brand shuttering its last remaining manufacturing plant in the U.S. in Hemingway, South Carolina, laying off 148 people, almost 150. They shouldn't say over 100. They should say almost 150. They issued the warn notice last week, alert alerting everyone that they plan to permanently shut it down. The notice and layoffs will begin in September, so July, August, September. They got 90 days. I mean, that's pretty much right away. The final closure of the plant set for January 2025. Tupperware said in a statement that it sold the Hemingway plant last year and plans to transition operations to Lerma, Mexico, noting that most of its products sold in the U.S. and Canada are already made at that plant. It's cheaper, obviously. It's important to note this decision is not a reflection of the performance of the Hemingway T. Tupperware said in the statement, the hub, I think they meant the Hemingway plant. I don't know why they put T. That's weird. We appreciate each of our valued team members and the many years of service they've dedicated to our sales force and to the company. Statement added that eligible employees impacted by the layoffs will be offered severance packages and early retirement, as well as the opportunity to connect with other businesses at an upcoming job fair. Tupperware, based in Orlando, Florida, I didn't know that, actually based right down the street from me about an hour away, has faced a series of struggles in recent years. 2020, the company initiated a turnaround plan and has been trying to execute goals including improving profitability, strengthening its balance sheet, and restructuring its debt ever since. Uh, Tupperware brand corporation was $1.48 and it dropped by a penny on the stock market. However, in a Securities and Exchange Commission SEC filing in April of 2023, a year ago, Tupperware said that the company had concluded that there is a substantial doubt about its ability to continue as a going concern for at least one year from the expected issuance date of its Form 10K financial statements. Tupperware appointed a new CEO, Laura Ann Goldman, in October. So what that tells me and what they're saying is they don't know that they can continue staying in business, which is interesting because Tupperware is a well-known name. People use it for everything. I've probably got 10,000 of them in my closet, my cabinet, like everybody. But I know there is some competing brands that do the same thing as Tupperware, but they have better snaps and connectors and closures and lids than Tupperware has and they probably took a ton of market share from them and that's why you know Tupperware is doing things now to cut their costs by going to Mexico interesting uh do I think Tupperware will go out of business that's a good question I, I don't know we'll have to wait and see what do you guys think leave it in the comment section do you think Tupperware will make it or do you think they might be going out of business we'll have to wait and see anyways as always thanks for watching the video if you could hit the like button it means a lot to me really appreciate that and please subscribe to the channel come back for future videos and keep watching i really really would love to have all of you here and i appreciate you if you do take the time to come here or leave a comment or like the video and hang out until next time have a wonderful afternoon and i'll see you later